political phraseology I'll comment on the fall of humanity In biblical phraseology I'll comment on the fall of humanity When Adam disobeyed his maker's behest By yielding to temptation at his request Through the abuse of the divine providence Mankind was doomed to suffer death and pestilence When the creator Adam's loneliness did perceive as a companion, he gave him the woman Eve. Fashioned out of his ribs while he was sleeping, she was destined to bring death and disgrace to him. And through his own moral incapacity, he ate of the fruit of the forbidden tree. Through the abuse of the divine providence, mankind was doomed to suffer death and pestilence. In a state of innocence he was made, he was the sole monarch of all he surveyed. Endowed with free will and understanding, these were the gifts the Creator bestowed on him. But the virtue of obedience he sorely lacked, and from the Garden of Eden he was promptly sacked. Through the abuse of the divine providence, mankind was doomed to suffer dead and pestilence. As he awoke to a realization of the fact that what he had done was an erroneous act. A consciousness of guilt overshadowed him. What he had done was termed original sin. He became susceptible to evil and his instinct became dishonorable. Through the abuse of the divine providence, mankind was doomed to suffer death and pestilence. The Lord in condemnation to him did speak, Tribulation thou shalt suffer for being so weak. The sentence he passed on him ended thus, Thus thou art, and thou shalt return unto dust. Sorrows and strife between all nations have been the lot of successive generations. Through the abuse of the divine providence, mankind was doomed to suffer dead and pestilence.